So you discussed on issues that you want addressed and I was asking a specific question how do you intend to execute that because you are targeting the president so how do you reach him mm, one let, allow me to say this so many legions in this country have been meeting so many caucuses but Mount Kenya has only started meeting as a caucus I know the caucus for Western meets. I know the caucus for pastoralist communities meets almost every week I know the Lift Valley caucus meets every week but now that Mount Kenya caucus has met, it's a very big issue. <laughs> uh, I wish to say. <laughs> Just answer my question. When someone from Mount Kenya talks, he's uh -huh. talking tribalism. But when other people Not are really. talking from other places, <laughs> they are talking for their people. S Sam, allow me to say this. Mm -hmm. One, we have discovered that our resources are shared in this country. Mm -hmm. There is a place where we are cheated as a legion. There is a place where we, we were not very keen as a legion. I want to give you a very good example mm -hmm. of a county we call Galiza County. Mm -hmm. Galiza County, as a registered voter population of 160,000, mm -hmm. Chukwe Gambangombe constituency where, where I represent, mm -hmm. we have 90,000 <coughs> registered voters. Mm -hmm. That is almost three quarter a county. Mm -hmm. Galiza County has six members of parliament. Mm -hmm. Six members of parliament. Mm -hmm. So when we share CDF in parliament, Galiza County will get 114 million times six. Chukwe Gambangombe, with almost the same population, we not only get 114 million. Mm -hmm. Because at some place when the borderless review were being done, our, play, our people were still thinking nationally. We were saying we are national leaders, the national cake will be shared equally. Mm -hmm. But we have realized the national cake is shared on borderless. Mm -hmm. It's shared to constituencies, it's shared to counties. Mm -hmm. When Commission for Revenue Allocation Formula was being drafted, mm -hmm. so much weight was put on, on space, on landmass, and the poverty. So you find that when we go to share, <laughs> to share the national cake, Trukana County gets 10 billion against a county like Kiambu that en ends up with, <laughs> with 6 billion. So some we, have, we have no problem. And I, you know the people who are saying that we are targeting the president, <coughs> are people who want to, to take us back to politics. Some as Mount Kenya, we have realized mm -hmm. that we are a legion mm -hmm. that has been put full time on campaigns. During Kebaki's time, the first time, we are struggling to put Kebaki on power. Mm -hmm. Then we are, immediately we erected Kebaki, we are put on campaign mode again mm -hmm. of Kebaki tenor. Mm -hmm. After Kebaki, we got in a very isolated campaign again of putting Uru in power. Mm -hmm. uh, when Uru got in power, we got into a very spirited campaign again of Uru Tano Tena. Now we are being put into another campaign mode of Uru places Uru or where Uru goes. As a region, we have said no. Mm -hmm. We are four years here. We are not going to any campaign mode. What can we achieve for our people these four years? When campaign time comes, we'll get into it as mm -hmm. other regions of this country. Thank you. Mwishimua Munene. <coughs> Just a moment. Mwishimua Munene. How will you achieve that? I've explained that very clearly. No, no, no. Through the president. I've no, uh, and I've put it very clearly. Is there a written document that you present to the president or he is going to read it from the press? You know, you are the one who to pull me to the president. <laughs> and I'm telling you, we, we don't want to achieve it through the president. The president does not delineate so constituencies it? in this country. We are going to a referendum. We know there are legions in this country during the last referendum who even faked census. The minister of Paranya said this census is fake. And they went to court, mm -hmm. and in a very calculated move, the case was taken to Justice Wasame, which I don't know was a coincidence or what, and they won the case, and they have continued taking almost half of the resources of this country. So we don't want to put the president at the task. Mm -hmm. We are in parliament. Mm -hmm. Boundaries are delivery is coming. We'll give our people the light share of constituencies in this country. Mm -hmm. The formula for 11 year allocation for counties will come to the to the parliament and not to the president, mm -hmm. we will make sure we have the right <coughs> formula to share resources in this country. Mm. Thank you. Uh, I'm, I'm very impressed with my brother uh, because for the first time, the Mount Kenya uh, group of MPs decided to pursue uh, the reasons why they were elected. <laughs> because immediately they were elected, they began to campaign for the deputy president to become the president. Mm -hmm. They forgot about uh, what is called service delivery. Mm -hmm. And I'm happy with the issues they raised in Naivasha. Mm -hmm. One of which was the resource distribution in this country, which I, I entirely agree with them. If you look at my constituency, Alego Songa is one of the largest constituencies, 115,000 registered yes. voters. Mm -hmm. Yet I receive the same amount of CDF like Within Barabara, another constituency, yeah, another constituency with three wards. Mm -hmm. and, uh, they, they, they get the same amount of money I get. Mm -hmm. I have 151 primary schools mm -hmm. and 51 secondary schools. Mm -hmm. I receive the same uh, uh, allocation as an, somebody who has 20 schools. Mm -hmm. There's an MP from Northeastern who told me that 
He has finished constructing all the schools. What he's now doing is buying buses for the school. <laughs> 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 While in my constituency, we have some schools that do not even have uh, kids are learning over under trees. Mm -hmm. So I think the conversion that the Mount Kenya group of leaders have begun is very, very important. I support them. I want them to abandon this business of running around the country, preaching William Ruto to become the president of Kenya. If you do that, then we are, we are going to be at par. And two, the fact that now we have begun <coughs> to support uh, the question of a referendum is something that we are going to stand with you because all these issues do with the resource allocation <laughs> can only happen through a constitutional amendment. No, Mwishimu, I will need to rectify you on that. No, no, I will need to rectify you on that. Can I finish, my no, But uh, you, can't, you can't, you can't finish, finish on, a, on a long note. Because if I have not finished. I'm, I'm just making if, my second but point. But remove the issue of referendum. We didn't discuss no, referendum. But, but, okay, let me... Let, let me but let is let not referendum. Let, 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 let me educate let you. Let me educate you. The constitution says that resources to the counties is will be not uh, not not um, not less than not less than fifteen percent mm -hmm. of audited uh, uh, financials. Now we want that fifteen percent shared well. Now we don't want it what we want to do, what what I think what we need to do, let us increase it to thirty percent so that a lot of resources <laughs> we can continue go to taking to the same counties again. <laughs> yeah, because let's sort the boundaries the first. Resource <laughs> distribution. Can, be, can only be done under the ambit of the constitution. Yes. There's no other route you know, to Because Mishimua, the president, Mishimua, Mishimua, even though the president Mishimua, comes from the region, he has no power Mishimua, you to allocate more you resources to you so well. than I don't, I don't why you, I, I don't know why But you're you interfering with my, 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 my because delivery. If, if, if okay, CDF can you say something, then you can today, respond. Yes. If CDF yeah. is, if you increase the amount of CDF today, and you have not sorted the boundaries review, uh, we have not sorted the formula of dividing CDF. It okay. continues to be a flat rate. Even if we increase CDF to add a billion, your constituent will still get less compared mm -hmm. to the constituents you are claiming about. So it's about the formula. What, it's I, about what, the what I mean, what I mean, it is that we, we, we don't, need, okay. we, we don't mm -hmm. need to increase the number of constituencies. We just need to look at uh, the the formula. Look at the formula. Yes. Yes. And, that, and, and, and but what we are saying mm -hmm. is that if we are going to if you are going to increase resources to our regions, that must go through the constitutional amendment. So you have to come. You, are, you need to come and support the, the, the referendum discussions we are having because ultimately you know, some um, of these things must be addressed. Do you know? Yes. Do you know how much uh, the effective percentage that is going to the count is currently? Uh, at least it was at around uh, that. The it was increased to thirty-five. The last the last 35. allocation. You know why it's not thirty-five? Yes, it was because it is based on audited. Yes, audi audi and audited accounts. Mm -hmm. Yes, as as we talk. Uh, audited accounts are those that were uh, the, f the financial year 2015. Yes. Mm -hmm. And we are now in the 2018. And the revenues were... So they, they yes. it could be even higher. About it, could be, it should actually be higher. Yes. yes. So what we are saying so is that maybe we need to change, we, we need to peg it yes. on the... On, on the, on the an audited uh, accounts of the previous. An audited accounts of the possible? previous financial year. Yeah, that's what we should do. You know, Sam, because you know, Sam, we are, right Sam, now we are. Sam, 